to Miss Mandy's story ballet class through the internet. I'm so excited to do this and I miss you so much, but we're gonna have a lot of fun today and you get to collect your own props. You get to live your own imaginative story in your own home. And then you get to come back and tell me all about it. I'm saving all the stickers and I'm saving all the stamps. And when you come back, you're gonna be tattooed all over. One for every class and every great thing that you've done. So first, let's come over to all of the props. And I need you to go get creative at home. And you're gonna grab some of the things you have at home that you could do these dances with. So I have scarves. We're gonna do the can-can dance. You can go get a dish towel or a pillowcase. That might be a little too big. Get creative, um, a doll dress, some piece of fabric. Maybe you have a scarf or a bandana, some piece of fabric that you can take from home and you can do the can-can dance with. Uh, then when we do Mulan, you'll need two. So maybe two dish towels or two war cloths. Okay, then we're going to do the pirate dance. You're gonna need to go get a uh, folded up blanket that kind of looks like a box shape. Or if you have a little treasure chest, you can get that too. Maybe you have a pillow. You could put the pillow in place of this, a stuffed animal, get creative. And then keep this in mind, because when you come back, I want to know all the creative things you did. I bet you got real excited. Okay, and then I'm going to have a wand. Maybe you have a wand at home. If you don't, go in the kitchen and get a dish spoon. Maybe you can get a Barbie. You can get an action figure. You can get anything you can hold in your hand. If you do get Barbie, be careful. I don't want her to get too dizzy. Because it will go real slow. <laughs> All right. So to start, we're going to stretch a little bit. I need you to sit with your legs straight in front in a pipe. Back nice and tall like a giraffe. Put on your crown. Remember, if you have a sluffy back, your crown falls down. So we'll sit up nice and tall today. Hey, I know head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And I know you know head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And no matter where in the world we are, we all have head, shoulders, knees, and toes. So we're gonna sing together. Here you go, start at your head. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. The eyes, the ears, the mouth, the nose. Let's try that again, those are wrong. The eyes, the ears, the mouth, the nose. Oh, what? One more. The eyes, the ears, the mouth, and nose. Oh, that's right. Now, head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Don't let go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Can you sing it? Super sonic feedback. Let's try it. Take deep breath. <gasps> head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, toes. Head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, toes. I said knees, toes, knees, Head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees, Whoa. Too fast. Man, I'm sweating. You want to try super snail slow? If we do that, maybe we can catch back up. Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Now, really fast. I didn't need to mess up. Head, shoulders, knees, toes, knees. Oh, great job. You did awesome. I like that. Okay, let's put our feet together like a butterfly. Let's see. Let's fly today. Because I know that even though Disneyland is closed, it's open for us today. So let's go. Flap your wings, sit up nice and tall, hands on your feet, keep them together. Oh no, I see a building! We gotta watch out! Wow! Ooh, come on, Daddy. We made it. Keep going. What do you see? Oh, I see Cinderella's castle. That must mean we're getting pretty close. But, oh no! Birds, watch out! Wow! Oh man. Almost there. Keep going, keep going. What do you see? Let's take it for a dive. Whoop! Big pike, hold it, hold it, hold it. And you've made it to Disneyland. What are you gonna do today here at Disneyland? What's your favorite ride? What's your favorite snack? Who's your favorite Disney character? I wanna know and save it for me later, yeah? All right, let's 
go back to that butterfly. We're going to hide our nose into our turtle shell. We're gonna lean back, hands on your ankles, look at your belly button, say hello belly button, and sit up nice and tall, giraffe back. Great job, one more time, nose to the toes. Nice turtle, good job. Lean on back, look at your belly button. Hello belly button. And sit up nice and tall. One more time, lean over, giraffe back. Turtle. Lean back, look at the belly button, and sit up tall. Good job, can we reverse it? We're gonna look at our belly button. Hello belly button. Nose to our toes, turtle. Straight, giraffe back. And sit up tall, one more time, a little faster. Belly button, turtle, giraffe, and tall. Great job, beautiful stretch. Straddle, oh, I picked this up. Okay, in our straddle today, let's make a pizza. I love a pizza. We are going to roll out the dough as far as you can in your straddle. Make sure you have happy toes, no sad toes, that hurts. Yikes, keep the happy toes. Go as far as you can, who can go the farthest? Okay, we're gonna reach really far. And you're gonna put on some pizza sauce. And then you're gonna reach really far and you're gonna grab some cheese. And then reach really far and grab your favorite ingredient and slap it on there. I bet it's pepperoni or unicorn sparkles or strawberries. Sometimes I can get chocolate on pizza, but that's okay, I'll eat it if you make it. Okay, and we're gonna put on our oven mitts. Turn on the heat, turn on the timer. Open the oven, slide in the pizza. Ooh, that's nice. Close the oven, and while you wait, can you try to put your elbows down? Happy toes, happy toes. Ding, 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 it's done. Put on your oven mitt, turn off the heat, turn off the timer, open the oven. Wow, slide out your pizza. Oh, I love it, it smells so good. Mm, close the oven, let's slice it up. Put a piece on each knee, nose to your knee, and heat it all up. Nom, 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 Delicioso. Mmm, let's eat the other side. Nom, 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 nom. Mmm, and I'm thirsty. I want a Slurpee. Let's put a straw in Slurpee. I know, you guys don't like Slurpees. Every time I suggest that, you say, no, I want apple juice. But today, I want a Slurpee, too. If you want apple juice, you can put this on apple juice. That's good. Take a big sip. on your face all the way from here. Wipe that off. Crazy kid. Why are you so wild? All right, let's put your toes on the mat. You're gonna love this one. Cause sorry mom, sorry dad, I'm gonna let them go crazy through the house. We're gonna be a roller coaster. And I want you to go all around the living room. Be very careful. Don't jump on couches and don't knock anything over. Here we go. Hands glued to the floor. Bottoms up. Tick, 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 tick. Hands go up. Tick, 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 relevate and go for a ride. Whee! Here we go. Ramba, mom, one, 
and again, round bottom on two, and again, round bottom on three, and again, round bottom on four. Now guess what we do? Plie, plie, and releve. Get up on your tiptoes, please. And now we do four, développe. Does anyone remember développe? What does that mean? Hmm. Hmm, that's the lower line right there. Hmm. Okay, développe is to develop. We take our passe and we develop it into a grand battement. We turn it into a grand battement. We're going to do four of those. So same thing, one, 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 one. De, la, pe, other foot. De, la, pe, other foot. De, la, pe. And again, it's de, la, pe. I can't wait to hear Alice say de, la, pe. Oh, it's so cute when you say that. De, la, pe. Okay, de, la, pe means to develop. Then we do plie, plie, releve. Now you add a tiptoe turn. Tiptoe turn. Then we do a rainbow. Now we're gonna do two of each. Two grand mama. One and two. And then two développe. De la pe. That's one. And de la pe. That's two. Now we're gonna do them a little bit faster. Plie, plie, releve. Plie, plie, releve. Yes, like that. Now tiptoe turn. Go kids. And a rainbow in the end. I don't think I got the tune of that song right. You know the song, but we'll figure that out in a second, okay? So now we take a big curtsy or a bow, Mr. JJ. Okay, and then Lily, make sure you do your curtsy with foot behind. Navia, you've been getting that too. So put that foot all the way behind you. Deal? Okay, let's start this with music. Feet together, six position, hands on your waist, smile on your face. I am ready to dance. Yes, here we go. You know I'm about to take forever. What else is new? Okay. 
hands on your waist, smiles on your face. I am ready to dance. Here you go. There once was a smart and strong-willed girl named Mulan who lived in a small village in northern China with her parents, older sister, and younger brother. One day, Mulan sat weaving, watching her father pacing the room. She asked, Baba, what is worrying you? Hmm. He had received a letter announcing that all the men in the country had to go to war. Mulan thought for a moment, Baba, I can go in your place, he asked her. How can you serve? You are only a girl. Yeah, right, huh? Only a girl. The next day, Mulan dressed in her father's clothes and said goodbye to her family. Mulan set off with the army. She traveled for many miles. She traveled for over 12 years. Whoa. Many nights she dreamed she heard her parents calling her name. I think you would miss your parents after 12 years too, huh? Let's hope there's happy ending. She fought and won many battles and she quickly became a commander. The emperor called all the triumphant troops to appear before him. Mulan was awarded with many pieces of gold for her courage and her service. The emperor asked Mulan what she most desired and Mulan replied that she wished to go home to her family. When Mulan got home, she was greeted with many hugs from her family. She was happy to see them. She went to her room, she took off her armor and changed into her favorite dress. She sat down in front of her mirror and brushed out her tangled hair and carefully applied color to her cheeks. Then Mulan rejoined her army buddies who were celebrating with her family. And the men looked at Mulan and they asked, how is it possible that we did not know our respected leader was a girl all along. Mulan smiled. One should not judge another by their appearance alone. When a pair of rabbits run side by side, can you tell the male from the female? A woman can fight any battle, and I am happy just to be me, Mulan, a strong and able woman. 
and men for Mr. JJ. I remember reading this book with Bella last week, I think, or no, this was the Leprechaun book, and oh man, you were so into that. So I hope that you can read some books at home and you can take this time to get a little bit more into your imagination. You know, creativity should be flying right now because you got all this time. So draw, read, paint, dance, do it all because this is just your time because this is what we've been waiting for. We've been preparing for this. Okay, so here we go. Mulan. Like I said, I'm just gonna dance through the story and you copy me. We're gonna start with our two, I got three, yikes. With our two scarves or two dish towels or two pillowcases or what have you. Okay, remember we start in the edge of the room. Am I good, camera? I can go a little bit more. Okay, that was kind of silly. Here we go. Move on. What else is new? Do the reflection. 
action dance? Because you know I skipped that one. I know you kids out there are like, no, Miss Mandy, you missed the dance. I'm a little nervous, okay? What's the difference? Okay, so let's do the reflection dance with the mirror. So this one would come second. I apologize. My bad. I tried so quick. Okay, so remember, we'll all be sitting on our knees, and then you get a turn to copy me. If you have a mirror, great. If you don't, just don't. Yeah, here we go. Do a quarter bra, no scarf. Hands come down on your heart. You'll have one turn. You stand up and you do a tiptoe turn. Arabesque. And the other way, arabesque. Do another tiptoe turn. And a curtsy. And then we'll go down the line. Each kid will have a turn. So if you want to do that again, feel free to rewind a little bit and practice. I know it's short. Maybe that's why I forgot about it. Okay, great. Last one. Last one is so fun. We are actually going to make a Chinese dragon. But we're not all together, so this is going to be kind of silly. I need you to take your dish towel, and you're going to put it over your head to make sure you can see. But we will all have our scarves, and we'll be connected, hands on the shoulders or on the hips, in a straight line, not very social distancing, so I understand why we got to do this through the camera right now. But put your dish towel on your head, make sure you can see, because mine is see-through and yours is not, and just follow my lead. And here we go, we're gonna hold hands. If you have a brother or sister you wanna do this with, you hold your hands to their hips or their shoulders, and we're gonna do bourrees around the room. I'll see you on the next class.